That is a sick way to talk about breathing, man. That's so sick. That's a sick way to describe it. This is total King 810 vibes, man. Damn. Proper King 810 vibes. Okay, let's go. Oh man, that's sick. I love how honest it is to man, it's pure brutal honesty. Oh mate, the massive King 810 rise, man. I love King 810. If you guys don't know them, it's kind of rap, kind of not, it's like metal. With like a with like a rap infused, but it's darkness, man, and it's telling stories, like stories of times he went through, times of his childhood, and the dark times, man. I guess totally like that, but obviously not as realism, but like you know that kind of style, that kind of sound behind it, which is very sick to listen to, actually, to be fair with you, but still. So, the carpet stinks for the filthy vomit up seeps in. It seeps, it seeps, it seeps into the fibers, while you cough up more pollen and poison. So yeah, as in like the carpet is like a metaphor for um, the atmosphere and um, the filthy vomit up as in like the fill as you breathe out the filthy vomit up is and it seeps into the fibers of the air into the atmosphere into everything else and then and then as you keep coughing got more and more pollen and poison because you breathe out poison technically in terms of first like if we breathed in what we breathed out we would basically, we'd basically die because of it and yeah pollen is obvious because we're obviously like around a lot of pollen like the like pollen plants and trees help us breathe and all of that good stuff as well obviously so i peered within and what i saw was a sticky hive of untapped potential it wants to form this it wants to form that but you can't keep it down as it pouts like no as in like as he went in as he saw within the mind he was just like you know what why do you have so much in here why aren't you using all of this why is all of this not a thing why are you just sitting back and doing nothing because of it why would you even bother with this man you have so much down here that you could use but you don't pout on your inner frame and let me in it screams but you'll have no such pain you'll have no such pain or you'll hear no such things feed the mighty mandibles of the insect queen she could fly sky high the tallest peaks remember when i swore i'd make something of nothing like remember when i said that i would show you the to the heights of what you could do when I could show you the heights of everything you could achieve and look where you are man you're not anywhere right now you're not that you're not anywhere to that point man you have to go higher than this you have to go better than this you have to become more than what you are because right now you're basically nothing you're in the depths of that drain that you were in trying to hold everything back man not allowing your dreams to go forwards not allowing any of that well for what it's worth I think I've succeeded. Toss this ball in your conscience. Throw it up, catch it on the way down. Who are we to suppress our dreams? I set them free. I make them be. I will make you bleed because of it. Like, that's totally what you should do, man. Like, these people who are trapped in their own guises in the in the whole armors, like, protecting them from things that, like, say, like, there's people who have dreams that they never even bothered to accomplish. They just go for the safety of, like, a regular workday or regular job or re or a regular whatever and their dreams are just left on the back burner and they just live their lives that way are they are they really happy in what they do no not really like I, I wouldn't say so i mean if i'd never followed my dreams if i'd never tried to make things how i want them to be now i don't know where i'd be i imagine i'd be pro probably like if I'm, if I'm thinking literally in a wheelchair if i had to work a regular job like every single day i think i would i think i would have to literally be in that place man where i would 
I be that way, don't call me out. <laughs> I'm sorry, love. It's not me calling you out, it's the dude who wrote up, so... He's calling you out. <laughs> but still, um... Let's see, uh... Let's see, um... I will make you bleed, whether, th whether through death or a fine tooth comb. Brush it back, brush it through the thought you've chosen. Trillions of people chuck their brain in a casket, call it a tragedy. Literally what I said, man. Like, like trillions because it's not just people who are alive, and people are, are, like, being born and dying every second, right? So, if you look back between all of human history, trillions of people just threw away their dreams for nothing. Threw away everything for nothing, for no reason whatsoever. And then ask the question you fear. What the fuck are you doing here? But it's too late to answer it with a decree. Melted it in the mouth of the insect queen of nothing, like... As in, what are you doing here? Why, what is your purpose? And you... <laughs> How dare I? I know it. How dare I? Man, this album is so lyrically deep, it's crazy. Yeah, biggest shot of the year for sure. These vocals are crazy, man. That's all I can say about this. He's just showing off at this point. I feel like he's, he's gonna go low with this, with him, I think. Maybe not, actually. I don't know. We'll see. Oh no, he's just repeating it. Like over here. Somewhere. Oh, that was cool. I like that. All the little vocal switches, man, damn. Like, you know, the, the post-production on the voice as well, obviously, but still. Like, that was sick. Like, they really end their song so strangely, like, so different towards anything else I've ever listened to. It's just totally unique to them, if that makes sense. But still. So, yeah. As in, like, you have to, like, this whole song is about why do you fear? your dreams why do you fear what you could potentially be why do you hold everything back for a purpose you don't even know for a purpose you can't even fathom why won't you let me help you why won't you let me set you free or basically like i've already forced you or i'm about to force you to let it free because you're going to get buried in it you're going to be soaked up to the thank you for the follow we're going to be soaked up to the depths of your waist for your thoughts and opinions and your dreams and to allow them to flow ever better and further and greater than you could ever imagine man but still craziness man just absolute craziness <laughs> 